Hi there, my name is Elena and today I want to talk about bio sites, how to create small sites with links. When I started to do this video, when I was preparing for this video, I had a list for almost 10 uh, different services about creating bio sites and I thought, okay, I will do a review of, for all of them. And when I started to create some sites for myself, just to check out what the difference between them, what the price etc and I figure out that <laughs> almost all of them are nothing because you it is beautiful uh, landing page, beautiful site, uh, features, uh, everything is so nice uh, when you see it on the first page. But when you're trying to do something, you can do without a payment, you can do it at all. Um, it could be like technical issues, something, something. So I left only two services that I want to share you. I used it uh, before, but I figured out how to use it in another way. So I will share with you. And maybe you know that the most popular popular service about bio sites is Linktree, but only one thing that it was able for me to create something beautiful in Linktree is this. So it is not too fancy, right? Because uh, you could choose a template, but all templates for design not so beautiful and not so useful, to be honest. And uh, when I try to add some text, like to add an email or something like text for this site, it was impossible because it is now any text box. You could add a contact box, but still, it doesn't work for me. Let's start from useful. <laughs> and for first one, I want to tell you about an Unfold. Originally, Unfold is an app for creating stories with a text, with animation, but then they started to create a bio site. So you could use it for free and use it with your own link. It's really nice, so this link is short. You could choose between templates. So first one is really nice, minimalistic. The second one is more or for fashion and that one really nice I tried it also also so good so if you don't have like uh, a lot of pictures photos or something you could use that one it's really 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 nice and see for tariffs you could use it uh, for free you don't need to pay if you want to like uh, uh, branding do branding changing colors or something you could do in a pro and using templates for stories as well because I use templates from them uh, also and they have a new templates beautiful for stories or for posts or for like different medias so yeah it is I, I really like really like unfold and everything they're doing Squarespace uh, boards them recently so it's a part of Squarespace and now I do understand that all this interface become a one part you should upload uh, unfold app so it is a site they created now I don't have like a lot of projects I have only my Etsy store so I, I added here Etsy store YouTube channel and Instagram and added some videos for example to show that it's really nice to put uh, like recently video from YouTube or or some popular video so people could watch it uh, here from the site and contact so you could add any text and add social medias as well and I really like its animation you see like beautiful animation when you come into the site and uh, picture on the top I really like it so you could choose what mood you want to share with the audience you're sharing it this link with and I will share you a interface so here in unfold app when you could choose a templates here then bio sites on the mm, last one and here I have my site I could do selection and see it's like so minimalistic interface and you could do not a lot of things but still you have a lot of options pre-made so you could add an Instagram post here as well uh, SoundCloud Spotify uh, video from Twitch from Twitter from Pinterest a picture uh, right on the site so you don't need to code anything or something you could add a text box only one restriction for free accounts that you could uh, do like five frames uh, see I have a free uh, account and you, when you want to add more sections you need to pay so but still like five 
sections is enough really enough to show everything you want and if it's not enough for you but you want to create a quick site without any uh, payment or without any design or complicated features let's move to the next one and the next one is Notion. I really like this app. I don't use Notion like a notes for my personal use, but I really like to create sites on Notion. And here uh, you could see like, if you don't familiar with Notion, is it an app that you could use for your team or for your personal use, uh, like creating lists if you're a list person, because I am and I really like Notion for it. So creating some spreadsheets uh, and all this fancy stuff. Uh, they have also like pre-made templates so you could choose from them and I'm a really big fan of text sites so mostly all my sites all my previous sites uh, for all my life was with text so I really like to create uh, telling people like with a storytelling or something and use my own photos so I don't use uh, any like illustration or like any animation or something and that's why I really like Notion and you could use it also for free you could create any pages for free uh, you could add even a domain so you could create a page and then add a domain to it it's really 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 nice so here is the site a mostly text site I choose the template called CV so you could create a CV as well on Notion and I started to recreate it so here I have like uh, my contacts a link to my shop with a description media links also uh, videos recently videos from my youtube channel and some uh, contacts as well so I just spent like 10 15 minutes on it and I have a unique link public link that I could share you could add a description for your links like to explain people what is project about or you could add a bio here and telling about your previous position previous work previous experience you could add like any links you don't have any limits here and it is better than using link tree to be honest because in link tree could add like three links or some fancy add-ons it is nice and okay but here you could add a text and tell people what your project about what are you about on which project you want to work yes yeah? so it is like uh, you're texting to people to like person you want to work or you want to tell them about your project about yourself and it's easier because you could you don't have any limits here so you could add just uh, h1 h2 um, a title and then add a text and either add a link and when we talk about editing it's really easy so i could show you here uh, you just could press a, a plus anywhere you want to and just choose from like text and you could see how it looks like so you don't need to edit uh, like to the list h1 h2 table mm, you could add a quote a divider and here as well so you could add a, a board view image video bookmark link file you could add file so if you want your people to uh, like download something for example you have a cv uh, on your site as well so like that person for example HR could uh, download your CV right from this site you could add an audio uh, embed it, um, Google Drive tweet uh, Google Maps so you could create the whole site so here uh, for templates you have like uh, different uh, options so you could choose uh, like for design for example it is like design uh, agency or you a student and you want to create like job application for example see and you could add everything you want to this table so I choose that one I will show you like personal and it is a resume so here is a cover you could choose any emoji you want to like uh, add your name uh, and just change it change the text here and here we go you have a resume and you could share it with your own link you could edit a resume cover letter portfolio link everything everything in one place that's why I really like notion and don't use it like in proper way for my personal use but I really like to create sites here 
And yeah, here is my suggestions. First one is unfold, really like the site. I will create an, another video with creating websites, websites, so which platform we use like Squarespace or Shopify, what is better for each type of content you have, but it will be another one. I hope it was helpful for you. Just write me a comment if you just found something new and, you, and when you will create a new site for yourself, you could share with me I could take a look maybe just do some suggestions or just saying hi to you I will be really happy to see if it was helpful for you and thank you so much thank you for your time you could subscribe I will add more videos more vlogs from uh, UK from my life and what is helpful for uh, creative people and yeah see you in the next video bye